in the midst of our lives that are constantly changing and always challenging. We need to find those places where we are on solid ground again, where we find our footing, where we get perspective as to what really matters in this life and what is less important. And I think that for many of us, the place where we find our footing and our perspective, that place where we find ourselves on solid ground and not in sinking sand, is right here in church. We come in here week in and week out. And you know, we Episcopalians, we pull out our books of common prayer and we opened up to the same pages and we say the same words and follow the same routine and structure every Sunday for years and years and years. And while we can be criticized for being boring and routine and kind of rote in our prayer life, what the Book of Common Prayer does is it grounds us. It, it gives us words and ways that we can count on in the midst of the changes and the chances of this life. We come here to find our center. We come here to be reminded of God's love for us, that God is in charge of this big old world of ours, and that um, we have nothing to fear when we remember that God is with us always. And the liturgy, the words, the prayers, the actions, the breaking of bread and drinking of wine, they, they pull us back together again so that we can leave here going back into this chaotic world in which we live. And they remind us, even more importantly, what that great prophet Micah reminds us in this weekend's readings from the Old Testament, that what does the Lord require of us but to do justice? That means just do the right thing, to love kindness, and to walk humbly with our God. If we do that, we will be able to make it through anything that this life throws at us. So may you find your footing here at St. Mark's. May you come to church on Sunday morning and find your way so that when you leave here, you can do just what Micah asks us to do, to do the right thing, to love kindness, and to walk humbly with our God. We'll see you Sunday.